What's the weirdest thing that you've ever eaten? I didn't even know that that was legal until it was served. Oh crap, that was very new to me. Wait, I think this might be disgusting to some audiences. We're gonna need a warning before this. Yeah, we could add a countdown just before it starts to get weird. Or for others, exciting. So if you enter inside without asking for permission, you are in trouble. So this is important to know where do we come from. The rules of the main heart. When we enter inside, women sit on the right, gentlemen on the left. So why women sit on the right side? Is it because women are always right? Just for the sake of peace. If you want peace, you tell them they are. Remember they say happy wife? And they lie, exactly. But the real reason, my friends, is because of what? The direction of the door. When you open the door, it opens on the right. So when the enemies are coming to attack, they will kick the door and all women up to the behind the door. These caterpillars are common in Africa and they are safe to eat. That's what they said. <laughs> when it comes to eating. So I skipped the appetizer. Yep, that was just a starter because it's about to get unique or weirder than this. Carnivore is a restaurant that features exquisite meat. Apart from the usual chicken, pork, and beef, they go around carrying this large skewers or swords and bring the meat to you. Zebra. 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 Wow. Huh? Thank you. Thank you. It was definitely an experience I would never forget. But since it was a buffet type, it wasn't really easy to remember what was on your plate. I did try segregating them to know which is which, but all the meat kind of looks the same. It was really hard to keep track. Wait, so antelope, chicken, beef, crocodile, and antelope. But some of them did leave quite an impression. Such as, I didn't know I like antelope meat. Though I'm not sure if antelope, kudu, veal, and venison are the same things. Then I honestly expected crocodile to be hard to chew because maybe I'm associating it with a rough skin. But they're surprisingly good. They do kind of taste like chicken. So to answer what is the weirdest thing that I've eaten, it's the zebra. I couldn't have imagined that one, it was legal to eat them, two, people actually eat them, and three, I could eat it without getting arrested or feel savage. Anyway, this is part two of South Africa Adventures. If you haven't seen part one where we had the most amazing wildlife close encounters, what you waiting for? We cuddled and walked with the lions like the best woods. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell if you haven't already and give this video a big thumbs up to let us know if you like these kinds of videos. I'll see you on the next South Africa Adventures coming your way. Bye!